Roblox often has sales for American holidays, such as Memorial Day, Veterans Day, 4th of July, and more. In today's case, we are talking about the President's Day sale, which lasts from the Sunday to the 17th of February. On this day, it's not just used to honor presidents, it's also home on Roblox to some exclusive items, such as Frenemy, Big Head, Bigger Head, Silverhorn Antlers, and more, and even some limiteds. Today is the 17th, and only one item has been made on sale on Roblox's behalf, which is the Festively Feathered Mask. And even if so, this item has to do with a different holiday. This makes me worried. What if Roblox slows down sales? As Green Lego Cats 123 brought up, could sales be off the market for Roblox or are they just slowing them down? With the decline of the market, this could be a possible issue. In today's video, we will discuss the decline of sales, why it's declining, yes, there's a valid reason, and my personal opinion on the matter. My name is Snooky Alex and this is our Roblox news and events series, in which we cover Roblox events in my opinion as well as leaks. Let's get started. Yo what's up Hashtag Nerd Squad and welcome back to another video. But before we get started in this video, make sure to subscribe for the latest Roblox news, drama, tips and tricks, and more. Also, thank you so much for the support on last week's video, it means a lot to me. We got over 32k views, and that's the most I've ever gotten on a video. To the influx of new subscribers, I think there are around 200 of you. Welcome to my channel, and I hope you will enjoy this video. With that being said, let's get started with the criteria for this video. The three criteria for this video will be Number 1. History of the President's Day Sale plus the current situation Number 2. Why is there no sale? I'll also be discussing that. And number three, how to improve the sale slash my final thoughts and words, also known as our conclusion. Let's get started with our first point, the history of the President's Day sale and the current situation. description of the President's Day 2019 sale said, New Year, New Year. To celebrate the upcoming President's Day holiday here in the United States, we're getting ready to feature dozens upon dozens of new and fan-favorite items to help all Robloxians find their perfect look. From Friday, February 15th through Monday, February 18th, we'll be showcasing a massive assortment of bundles, hats, faces, gear, and more in the catalog. Keep your eyes peeled on our Facebook and Twitter pages all weekend long to know which items are up for grabs. Don't miss your chance. So, which items will be spotlighted this year? We'll give you a hint. Below you'll find just a handful of the items that will be featured this weekend. We can't spill which items are on the new returning or going limited, so you'll just have to wait for the big reveal starting at 6am PST on Friday, February the 15th. From what it's seen, the last official Roblox sale was the President's Day sale 2019, in which apparent criticism was gained for an orc mask and face, which could be gained for free because of glitches. Roblox later fixed this and refunded some of those. As well, the item's values were very low to buy the orc glitches, and they later went down, gaining criticism in the sale. This could be one reason why Roblox discontinued the sales, but it's probably not apparent due to the low actual reasoning of it. In for the history of sales, sales have existed since 2007, almost 12 years ago, even younger than some of my audience, and they have been a continual history on Roblox. The President's Day sale, I believe, has existed since 2013, and it is a yearly event. The President's Day sale and Memorial Day sale share very similar items and traits, with some of the on-sale items taking on a patriotic theme of American culture. It doesn't apply to me or internationally because I'm Canadian and discounts ranging from 30% and even 50 or 60% off as analyzed. The items that they share are similar are the Big Head, Bigger Head, and Frenemy, with many taking into arms on Twitter with hashtags such as Frenemy or Riot, etc. Why are people so angry if the sale, if so, is minimal this year? And why is the sale minimal? On to our next point in which I shall explain why the sale is minimal. This point also has to correlate with directly in this point. Let's get started. When 
I covered Black Friday 2019, the sale was minimal on Roblox's behalf and that's why many were complaining about it due to only 5 items being on the sale. However, many UGC creators decided to reduce the price of their items, making an unofficial UGC sale that certain items were promoted by Roblox. As Roblox adds live ops and many more community-driven things, the ultimate goal is to make Roblox a fully autonomous platform driven by developer and community-based products, such as games, UGC, and that's why they were added. It takes a workload off Roblox and allows them to do other projects and focus their creative energy to supporting these creators and helping them appeal it to their player base. Essentially, Roblox acts in itself as a platform and not a game, as it is multiple. Roblox acts as the middleman and that's what they are trying to do here. By Roblox's contractors, it's very expensive, and essentially UGC does the work for free for them. This means more funds to be put into another project, which can also be a positive. However, it is a negative, as you can see some of the creators directly suffering from this who originally were contracted, such as my friend Jaunty8 Games. He used to make hats for Roblox, but Roblox keeps making less and less actual hats based off Roblox and instead has driven them to UGC, but they still won't let him in. Kaneko also covered this topic on how the original contractors are suffering out of work because of this. This is why we see less limiteds, etc., because Roblox wants to focus on a more middle economy based off UGC. In Roblox's replies, the community is very angry. I'll read you some. Uh, could we get a sale or at least a limited item today? Yes, please. What about the sale? There is no sale. Nobody cares about Arthro. We just want President's Day sale. What about the sale, fam? So did you just forget about the sale? President's Day sale. Thanks. Where the F is the sale, Roblox? Aren't we getting a sale today? Sale, sale, sale. You're going to meet my fist if you don't give me the President's Day sale. Where is President's Day sale? There really don't be sale, though. Already deleted from not having a President's Day sale. What about the sale, fam? Guys, there is no sale. I mean, seriously, when has Roblox actually cared about something? When, when, I want President's Day sale. Roblox, stop being lazy. Start communicating with your fans. Not doing something? Talk to us. Let us give our opinions without going black and not responding. We just want a sale. Keep up your traditions. Now, I do not know how to pronounce that person's name, but they have a really good point here. Because Roblox is not being lazy, but they certainly could put in some more effort. They need communication, and this is the problem about the sales. The sales this year have had absolutely no communication. It's more of just an item that's been put up for fun or five. This is why people are upset. Every one of the else of the comments keeps saying President's Day sale. And in this thread, it looks like in the thread, it's just an Arthro announcement contest. And no one cares about the actual contest. They care about the sale. Community's opinions, let's get started with our final point. In conclusion, the Roblox sales weren't really cancelled. Roblox just energized their energy into a different form through the UGC sales, which aren't official. Roblox may do sales in the future, but they are to a very minimalistic aspect. Also, there are also creators being affected by this that are not in the UGC program, yet were contracted by Roblox. I'll leave a link in the description so that way you guys can go check them out. Thank you so much for watching my video. I'd appreciate if you subscribe and turn on notifications, so that way you never miss out on one of my videos. Thank you to my subscribers in the poll section for suggesting this topic. I'll see you in the next video, and peace out. Oh, yeah.